want to tell you a story. A story about my wife, Heather. She's a wife, a mother, a student, a professor, a nurse, a daughter, a sister, and I love her immensely. Proverbs 18 tells us that there is power of both life and death in the words we use. That's most often interpreted and taught to mean that the words we speak to others have extreme power. While I wholeheartedly agree with that, I want to expound on it a little more. There is also power of life and death in the words we hear and power in the words we say to ourselves. Oftentimes, our inner monologue takes over us and begins to fill us with self-doubt. But much more than self-doubt, it becomes self-deprecation. In an effort to overwhelm that negative inner monologue that's full of lies, I turn to you, our friends, to shift the power of these words. And you came through in remarkable fashion. You wrote the words and descriptions that you had seen and experienced from my beautiful bride. It's time to shine the light of truth and life into the darkness of lies and death. With your help, I wanted to make something tangible and lasting as a reminder of the life and light emanating from this remarkable and precious woman. There is power in our words, and you get to choose to speak life or death. Heather Dawn, you are loved by so many, but none more than me. You were made on purpose and for a purpose, and I thank you for being so life-giving. I love you.